Hey y'all, it's Gypsy, and I'm here at Leeds Gallery talking about my individual pieces. This piece is called The Boy with the Pearl Earbud. Um, this is uh, Michael. He is my partner's son, um, so he is also my stepson. Um, and uh, we did a photo shoot with Michael, and I did another painting of Michael, which is over on the other wall there. Um, but the whole time, I was doing the painting of Michael, I kept looking at um, his earbuds. And I had this idea. Um, it's not really an original idea. There are lots of other artists who have done um, appropriations of uh, Vermeer's A Girl with a Pearl Earring, which is what this is uh, an appropriation of. Um, and, um, you know, it's interesting the painting by Vermeer, Girl with a Pearl Earring. Um, the young lady is described as uh, vulnerable and mysterious. Um, and so that um, s made a little spark happen in my brain. Um, Michael is also vulnerable and mysterious. <laughs> he is many things. He is gentle and serious, uh, playful and adventurous, athletic and creative, uh, and he is quick-witted and articulate. Um, he is racially fluid. He and his brother are both uh, Dominican and Puerto Rican. He is many things, um, but still too many people see him as only one thing. Um, a story that um, his mom likes to tell of his uh, quick-wittedness. Uh, one time, it was probably a year ago, they were at the eye doctor and the, the eye doctor's assistant was doing things, right, with all the machines, and um, she said to Michael, so, uh, where are you from? And he said, I'm from Richmond, Indiana. And she said, no, like, where are you from from? And without missing a beat, he said, well, I was born in Iowa. <laughs> so, uh, you know, the conversation changed quickly <laughs> after that. Um, anyway, so when you look up, um, Vermeer's um, painting, The Girl with the Pearl Earring. It's really interesting, the art historical facts that you find. Um, and for in this particular instance, because the facts are very speculative and assuming, um, the young woman uh, is unknown. No one really knows who she is. Um, there's lots of stories about who she maybe is, but no one really knows. The pearl earring is a symbol of vanity virginity and wealth. Um, the clothing and the turban are Turkish um, because the painting was completed around the time of uh, the, when the Crusades were still happening, um, 1500s. Um, so the, it's considered very exotic. Um, the painting background, which now reads as black, um, was not black to begin with. It was a dark translucent green. Um, and the paint was made from black indigo and weld, which is yellow. Um, all of those things are imported, meaning conquered or colonized. The young woman, um, the pearl earring, the clothing, and indigo was a product that was um, import imported um, to make for, for lots of purposes, dyeing fabric, but also making paint. Um, so to place a young brown man in the place of that young woman is my attempt to address the speculation and assumptions that we make about people, but in particular um, brown people, young brown men, um, and all the history that comes before him is dismissed. Um, he is reduced to a one note, not in the way that Vermeer's painting is reduced to a one note. Uh, his painting is reduced to a one note of uh, a beautiful young woman. Um, but Michael's painting, um, my painting, is reduced not to a portrait of a beautiful young man, um, societally, but of a target. Uh, through decontextualization uh, and the oversimplification of his skin. 
Um, he is, through that experience, the definition of resilience.